So in this tutorial, we will see how to draw this 2D diagram in AutoCAD. Let's start. Go to new file. Open. Now here first we will set the limits in AutoCAD. Maximum length of this diagram is 15 plus 40 plus 15. Again this 25 which is 130 mm. So here we will set the limit more than 130. Suppose 160. So go to AutoCAD. Type limits. Select this limits option. Lower left corner will always be 0, comma, 0, enter and the upper right corner will be the maximum limit that is 160, comma, 160, enter. Now here select the zoom option and zoom out. Now first of all we will draw this horizontal reference line. Then we will offset it by 40 distance. We will draw one more line. To so select the line, make sure that ortho mode is on. Select first point and second point of the line. Escape. Now select the offset option over here. Distance of offset is 40. Enter. Select the line. Offset it. Enter. Escape. Now we will draw one more vertical line. This is again for the reference purpose. So this will be that vertical line. We will offset this vertical line by 40 distance, then by 90 distance and then by 85 distance. We select the offset, select the distance to offset, first is 90, enter, select the line, enter. Enter again, select the offset distance 85, enter, select the line, again enter, enter again, again enter, select the offset distance 40, enter, select the line, skip. Now here we will first draw this. 30 mm diameter circle and this 12 mm diameter circle. So here select the center diameter. First draw 12 mm, enter and select again. Enter 60, sorry, 30 mm, enter. Okay. Then again we will draw one more circle at a distance of 12 enter we will just join these two circles escape escape okay. now we will draw this circle of 30 mm diameter so just select the circle and draw it of a diameter which is a 30 mm and enter just then we will just draw this 20 and then 60 mm diameter circle so here it is 20 mm and again 60 mm diameter circle enter now here we will remove the unwanted part so first select the cutting edge this will be cutting edge and enter now this will be unwanted part escape we will just connect these two from diagram escape ok now we will just draw a line which will be tangent to a 30 mm circle and 16 mm circle so here select line and here select in snapping option tangent option should be selected here so now select the line so it will be showing tangent option here first point second point so this line will be perfectly tangent to these two circles 
Now again, draw one more uh, line from here. Escape. So this is that line. Now we'll draw this 50 mm radius circle tangent to this line and this circle. So here select the tan tan radius. So select the first tan. Select the second tan. Now define the radius of the tan that is 50 and then say end. So in this way we have drawn. Now select the trim. Enter. Select the unwanted part. This is unwanted. Okay. Escape. Now select again the trim and select the cutting edges it will be better for the trim purpose select the cutting edges trim the unwanted part now enter trim the unwanted part escape so in this way we have trimmed the unwanted part one more is remaining select the cutting edges escape enter and this now cutting edge will be in this case this so trim so again select the trim select this this enter and select the cutting edge ok that is fine ok so in this way this Diagram is completed. Now we'll just minimize this length of these lines. Enter. Select this and stretch it up to this. Enter. Escape. Again, select this, stretch it up to this. Escape. Select this, stretch it, escape. This is the perfect drawing. Now we'll define the layers over here. So for that, click on layer properties. We'll define the layer. First is the continuous layer. We'll define the color for this layer to be ok so this is the color now we will define one more layer that is the for center purpose define it is center yes center enter select the line here load the line load the line center so here center select the center ok center ko select ok so in this way center is selected we will just select for center ok in this way now shut down this now select for the center these lines ok now go to layer again and define center so this will be center now escape so this will, these are the center lines thank you for watching